Well, folks, I, I, I'm sure you know by now, but this brilliant woman to my left, your right, has, has announced her retirement from Channel 5. And I'm, I'm not going to cry right now. I may cry when she actually does leave, but she's announced her retirement. Thank you, James. So I don't, she has no idea that this is about to happen. But Oh, my goodness. Yes, really? yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Really? <laughs> and, and Mayor, would you just would you just read one of the one of the entries? And the, the, the city of Boston has a proclamation. This is my ticket to skip the pop quiz. <laughs> <laughs> when I came to Boston, I, everyone kept talking about you. And growing up, people would always call me Woo because it was an unusual name then. And, and that is, I learned in Boston, I could not be Woo because you were already <laughs> Woo to everyone. Um, so thank you for all that you've done for the community. Um, the proclamation reads, whereas Janet Wu has been a trailblazer in Boston for women and women of color in media and broadcast journalism, leading by example and setting a standard of excellence, where she has demonstrated her commitment to fairness, accuracy, and inclusion throughout her legendary career, and has been a tireless advocate for our community and the API community. Now, therefore, I, Michelle Wu, Mayor of Boston, do hereby proclaim November 6, 2022 to be Janet Wu Day in the city of Boston. Which is today. First of all, I can't believe you managed to do this uh -huh, without me right, knowing about right, this. Second right. of all, I don't cry very often, but I am getting pretty teary. Thank you very much, and I don't know how much of that is really true. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. I really appreciate this it. This is nice. We'll be right back. You don't mind if I look at it, do you?